you know this is the daily african proverbs and i've always wanted to have you as a guest for this show so it's just beautiful that you're here and we are discussing an african proverb uh, we do this monday to friday where we pick an, a new african proverb and we we talk about it we get some african wisdom from it and uh, with the hope that when this the session ends everybody leaves with some 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 wisdom that they can equip themselves with uh, for the day so today we are taking a virtual journey to angola and the proverb that we are discussing says the squirrel does not talk back to the elephant and some of the some of the takeaways from this proverb uh, that i wrote before we started are you know not every battle is worth fighting and then the second one is you know consider the consequences of your actions before you take those actions and then the third one is you know know when to walk away um and i was giving an example of last night's uh situation where will smith slapped uh chris rock you know and uh, you know he had the option of fighting that battle he had the option of walking away he had the option of uh you know he considered the the actions that he took before he 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 acted i also gave the example of president putin of russia he he chose to invade ukraine despite the consequences of those actions and also the option of walking away you know uh, and not being involved in you know in the in in the battle especially at this time in the history of the world so you know just knowing all the amazing work that you've been doing in the world you know here in seattle uh in the in the u.s in the in the diaspora uh in ghana in kenya uh you know I just wanted you to take a stab at this proverb share with us what comes to your mind when you think about it and then from there we are going to just go a little deeper uh and also we are going to talk about you know some of the work you do as the director of multicultural outreach and engagement at PLU and after that we will talk about the African communities engagement scholarship uh so thank you again thank you again for being here I'll pass you the mic Oh <laughs> wow, the squirrel doesn't talk back to the elephant. Is that's that right. it? That's right. That's right. <laughs> okay, cuz sometimes, I mean, immediately I thought you could win the battle but lose the war. You know that that uh that came to me cuz every fight just isn't every fight just isn't one that you should jump into. You could just use use your head. I mean, you know, and I, and I've seen that time and time again in my career. It's like okay, especially over social justice. You know, when we're talking about being in the human rights, and I've been in the human rights career field my entire uh, life, and I mean work life. So we're talking about at least four and a half decades, five decades of actually working. Um, and i think about the systems that uh, i have encountered along the way that that we're trying to dismantle and disrupt and even in in this world it could i mean you could say um that that people of color in this american system are the squirrel <laughs> you know you could say that maybe um but then I like to think, you know, as this squirrel, I could still figure out I might not need to go in the elephant's face at this point, but I sure can go under the elephant or around the elephant. I could stick something in the elephant's foot. I could do something too. That's <laughs> you know? true. That's true. That's true. <laughs> the elephant isn't as flexible as I am. And so, you know, as a squirrel, I could go fast. I could climb trees to the top you know there's <clears throat> there's all kind of um goodness in me as a squirrel so yeah i would figure something out but standing and and over the years i've had to 
right? So you stand there and you look at this big old system 